Hello everyone and welcome back to Conquest, where today I am kind of sick, so if I sound extra nasally than normal, that's why. Anyway, so today, it's, uh, it's looking like there's a general consensus going on in the comments of the last video that I should do a sector with only units for defense. And I thought, you know what, that's a good idea. Now I have the option between this extreme base here, this high threat here or here, the high threat here, or the medium threat there. Now, I know everyone wants me to do this extreme base, but I'm going to make this one extremely difficult, so I'm going to try to find a harder challenge, because I don't think this is going to be too hard. So instead, I'm going to go for 197, mostly because I have resources in 196, I can just launch right over. The only other place that I can launch from 196, which, you know, has resources, as I just said, is 195, 50, and 110, which are all medium or low. That's not really entertaining, so... Looks like it's 197 today, and then 199 next time with a harder challenge when I'm not sick. 197. Big core. No export hub. Only units. Let's go. Looks like there's some oil here. Very nice. <coughs> oh, God. Ugh. Ugh, cut that out. <laughs> Okay, uh, it looks like there's some oil here, that's good. And we got water as well, spores are plentiful. Uh, this is all sand, right? Yep, it's all sand here. How much lead is on the map? A decent amount, so I could theoretically make this into a glass factory. Oh my god, wait, is, hold on. Is that the only vein of oil on the map? Boo! The only oil is in the drop zone, so I can't use it. Oh, dude, that's so annoying. Every time I say anything that has a letter N in it, it makes my sick sounds so much worse. So I'm just going to avoid the letter N for the whole video, probably. Uh, wish me luck. I'm, I'll need it. <laughs> okay, let's do some critical thinking here. Uh, so here's the drop zone. And here's some uh, derelict bases. I think that's just going to blow up, but I should probably start getting... Re oh, wait. Oh, I forgot. I can only use units. So... Do you count the core guy as a unit? All right, let's go look, hold on. Core database. Units! Oh, that's Horizon. Where is it? Oh, it's better, it better be here. Am I stupid? Oh, yeah. There you go. See, it's under units, so that means I can use my, my core guy. Oh, yeah, have you guys heard the, like, squishy noise that this makes? Ugh. Okay, so that should be copper good. Let's get some lead going. Okay, there's copper and lead. We got 45 seconds. Oi! Oi! What's they're doing? There's some snow trying to sneak in here, dude. I can see you! I'm getting distracted very easily today. This is going to be an interesting video. Okay, well, let's go watch the, uh, the thing get blown up. I'm gonna sit here with free cam, which I had to rebind, by the way, for everyone asking what the button is. I don't know. Just go bind it. Uh, is this gonna get blown up? And then the units just start burning. Okay, this is really not good because there's uh, there's three shielded units right off the rip. So, yeah. I cannot range them though, so that's good. Yeah, so anything past wave five, I think it's just game over for me. So I'm going to have to get some stuff going like right now. Okay, let's grab some quick uh, graphite here. Someone said that I should do a hard sector with only combustion generators, and I just want to say that is the most evil thing I've ever heard. I'm totally doing that. That'll be later. It's on the list. I have a big list of stuff that I'm gonna do. And no, I will not read you anything off of the list, because that would spoil it. Darn, 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 darn. This is gonna get really rough really quickly. I'm just going to sacrifice my drone there and then respawn at the core to get some health back. I think that's a good idea. Is there more titanium up here? Yes, there is. Okay, I'm going to go grab that. Okay. Um, next order of business, I think, is going to be... I'm going to reserve this coal vein and some of the water up here to make uh, steam generators. Uh, can someone spot the error right here? Yeah, anyway. Um, that was really stupid. And you can't mine sand. You can't mine sand out of the water? <gasps> so that's just gonna run this like this. It's gonna be incredibly slow, but I honestly don't care. Man, I really should have used my X card hub for this. Oh, we're out of copper. Okay, um, that's lovely. I need to go shoot those units before they get close. I need to remember that. I'm gonna forget one time, and I'm just gonna be sitting there over the core watching it get blown up, and that's gonna be no good. 
I know these things have tracking bolts, because, like, I'm my mouse is shooting over here, but they just keep moving. But, like, bro, shoot the guy in the front. Actually, I'm going to watch this guy. Where is he going to go? There's absolutely no way you're choosing to go straight. Oh, that's not good. <sighs> Bruv. Oh, yeah, 45 waves, by the way. I don't know if you guys saw that, but I did. So we're dead. This is going to be super expensive. Okay, um, I can't afford that. I'm going to try to build a wall here so the enemy... The six and units, I forgot about that. Oh, and I turned weather off again for the thumbnail. Okay, we got him. Let's go. I turned weather off again because I was taking a thumbnail picture, so let me turn it back on. Yay, now it's raining. This is probably going to ruin compression, but it looks so much cooler to me, so I'm leaving it. Okay, there we go. That should be enough. And there we go. We're getting silicon. We have like 100. Okay, I'm going to... I... Do I want to split that off? or do I... Yeah, I'm going to focus that entirely on making units because we're going to need it. Uh, I think I might just make... I'm going to make some tier 1s, but I don't know which ones. Oh, I totally could make boats, dude. Wait, boats are actually insane for stuff. I forgot about that. I could totally just wall off the other tier areas and just have them rock, walk through the river and just get obliterated by the boats. That sounds like a cool idea. We're totally doing that. Oh my god. Actually, let's just go take a look at the database and see what I can make. So I can make Dagger, that's just not good. Nova, do these heal each other? Oh, they do. Okay, so maybe we do Novas, because then they can just heal everything. Mono, they don't even attack, so that's not good. We could make some Rezo. They do a lot of damage. What about... Oh, these are... Oh, those repair blocks. What about you? You have a... Oh, you have an overclock status field? Oh, right, yeah, I forgot. Those actually do that. So I'm either doing the healer boats or Nova. Do I want to spend... Uh, lead or glass? And the answer is glass. We're gonna take a three-way splitter, and we're gonna take two-thirds of the silicon, and we're gonna bring it down here, and we'll have one-third to the core for building stuff. Yay! That should hopefully fix that. Okay, and we need glass now, and there's seven units, and oh my god, I've made a mistake. Okay, uh, we need to get glass now, so let's do that. And then you can just get split off to there, and then big power node right there. Glass. You know, I saw a logic schematic a while ago that had a unit just go replace all the normal lines with titanium lines, and I thought that was the coolest thing ever. Might have to go track that down in music. Okay, uh, they got really close, so we're gonna have to get these units built like yesterday, so let's choppity choppity on that. You know what, just as an, a thing to do, we're gonna wall this off now so I don't forget later. That's way too much wall, dude, I don't have time for this. Let's see if I can catch them like right as they get here. Oh, there is scrap here, but guess where it is? In the drop zone. Build, everything is fine. Okay, let's get this factory built because we can do it now. Bam. Let's try, actually, let's try to do this. We can grab enough titanium from this top part that theoretically we can just put some walls on it and they won't pay attention. That's probably overkill on the titanium as well. We really don't need that much. Oh no, dude, this is bad. Get the glass going back in. I'm going to send glass entirely over there. Hopefully, we can get a unit. Build Rattusa. Send the units there. There's only three units. Oh. Oh, no! Okay, so these can't even shoot me, because they only shoot ground, so I can just sit here and kill them. Oh my god, please die. We got a unit yet? Oh, we do, we got one. Sweet. Okay, and these things will heal each other and walls, I believe, and me. Let's just add, like, a, a cup kind of thing here, and then have you go behind it. Oh... So they want to heal the wall before shooting the enemies. I guess that we that wall thing will not work. You can go here. Okay, there we go. So hopefully they'll just shoot at the enemies now. If power, no. Okay, so I think the next thing I'm going to try to do is get power. Hopefully these guys... I'm going to help them, obviously, but hopefully they can take this out. And they have shields now. Great! There we go. And they're healing each other. Perfect. This is very ideal. Okay. 
So now the next order of business is get more power. Tell me you don't need. Oh, you need graphite for steam gens. Ugh. I gotta do it, man. Okay, well, uh, I just decided it was quiet time and uh, spaghetti building time at the same time. So I built uh, all this spaghetti here, got some lead, some coal. Uh, I pumped up some water into the sand drills to get more sand so we can get sand into here, which we can make pyrotite, which we then shove in a differential generator, which then we get cryofluid, which I don't have titanium yet, but I can get some right there, and then we'll have some extra power. Now, the whole reason I did that is because it doesn't need graphite, and uh, I just really don't want to deal with that right now. But anyway, the wave is here, so let's go figure out how many units I have and hopefully watch them destroy everything. They almost did. Yep, could have been way worse. Okay, that wasn't the worst. That was actually okay. Okay, so these guys are good. So once this is done, I believe I can just switch it over to Rezo because it'll just use the exact same things. Oh yeah, dude. Look at that. Sheesh. Oh, 2,000 power, dude. First time I've seen it. All right, now let's help these guys. Okay, so now they don't do a crazy amount of damage, but they do a decent amount. Yes, I am well aware that you can just put an unloader and then put another thing down. I just forgot last time. I'm an idiot. My bad. And there we go. Now we can also build Rattuzas at double the rate, and then we can swap over to these guys at double the rate, and that will be very good. Okay, <clears throat> we got 35 seconds before that makes life. Let's get Graphite. And uh, all I have to do is hit build on that when we have Graphite. You're supposed to go there. Crawler, got demolished, sweet. Oh, that one got demolished. Okay, so it looks like these things don't really work well against shields. So if I pop the shields off first, then we'll be golden. Oh, those are torpedoes. Okay, that's actually cool. Oh, graphite for days. Okay, so now I don't need to worry about graphite. Okay, so you... I'll just leave you, whatever. So that should do for sand. Hopefully that'll max out the line. We don't have to worry about that. These build incredibly slowly, by the way. Jeez. 13 enemies? God. Holy! Yep, get hosed. Oh, dude, I'm actually using this water to my advantage because they move slower, so... You probably couldn't hear a word I just said. I'm actually using this water to my advantage because they move slow in it, so that's cool. And we're about a third of the way there, and we finally have defenses that can actually hold up. Still got a decent amount of power. I would like some more, though. Okay, I just had a thought. I'm very lucky that there hasn't been any flying units yet, because if there was, I would be dead. Because these things shoot underwater torpedoes that can't even go on land. You are now making Rezo because we are maxed out on Rituza as of right now. And there's another a lot of power, 4.6k. Now let me just grab the U and put you right there and make sure we have just enough. Okay, so we're up to 5k power, so that's good. Yeah, see, they'll start shooting at those before they get to the water, and then the torpedo barrage will go off. Um, something that would be nice is overdrive. So let's grab a quick plastanium factory with some. And there's some quick plastanium. Not a lot, but we're going to get some. Okay. Oh, that looked like an air unit. Yeah. Uh oh. <coughs> Uh-oh, 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 uh, -oh, uh, -oh, uh, -oh, uh -oh, priority emergency five. I don't know what that means, but we have a problem. Uh, let's, uh, the, let's look at the database. As to me, it looked like a quad, and that is very scary. So we need to, uh, get some, some, a, a little some something cooked up here. Uh, how about, uh, something that can shoot things out of the air? Uh, how about you? I think I'm just going to have to make a bunch of zeniths, you know? Uh, yeah, let's do that. Okay, so we're going to have to run some very sketchy power lines behind the enemy lines. But it's fine. Oh, God. No, I had to say something. I literally had to. I said, oh, yeah, there probably won't be a guardian here. So that means we need one silicon a second. Epic. Additive reconstructor. Four. So that means we need five. Multiplicative. Four and a half. So we need, like... 11, 11, 11 silicon a second. That's not too bad. What? Uh-oh. I'm going to do what's called a pro gamer move. And I'm going to launch tit titanium over to the sector because I am not going to sit here 
and watch that guardian destroy my base while I can only build tier twos to defend. So, yep. Off it goes. Boom. Okay, you know what? I am going to care not about power. I just don't. I, I, I don't have... I literally do not have time to care. Uh, lead. Pirate tie. Yippee. And then that makes ten and a half. Yeah, if you're wondering, yeah, this is... This kind of factory building is called I'm going to die. I need to go as fast as possible. Ah, more water. Uh, another unloader. Lead. Where is the lead? I don't know. Where's lead? Hello? Lead? Yup. Uh-huh. No, yippee. Six? I think it's time. Okay, so that will boost all the coal producers and the factories. Yeah, that. Uh, all of that. Ah. All right, and now we have some zenith. Holy, that's going to take forever. Why'd I do that? Okay, well, batteries. Five waves to go. That is, in fact, a quad. Okay, yeah. Hopefully there's only one. Last time I was fighting bosses, I was panicking, and then two of them showed up, and I was even more panicking. We might actually have a chance here. Although, maybe not. Maybe I'll just get obliterated. Hopefully this fleet of Zeniths will be enough. I, I I don't know if it will, because they do have shields. But they do only drop bombs, so I don't think any of them will get destroyed. Two waves to go! Can I build these? Oh, okay. Well, I was going to build some repair turrets... But it has turret in the name, so I guess that would be cheating, so we're not going to do that. Okay, so basically, one wave, yeah, it's basically just a waiting game. It is time! How many of them are there? Just the one? Good. Where's it coming from? Oh my god, it's over there. Nope, die. It doesn't have a shield, and we're, like, literally just holding it in place. And it's getting obliterated. Uh oh. Oh dear. It's too fast. It's too fa It's too fast. This is not good. It's too fast. Ouch! Now that the batteries. Oh, that's oh my god, that does. Holy! 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 We lost the Zenith, boys. Bad news, power got cut. Uh-oh. Oh, you know what? Oh, oh, oh no. How, our units are all alive. Okay, that thing literally just went straight for batteries and uh, almost succeeded. Right. Um, can we get the power back up, please? Thank you. Uh, well, my Zenith army almost got demolished. Uh, that could have been really bad, but it, it wasn't, so that's, that's good. And then we can use them for uh, defenses as well. Because I think that's the only wave we're going to have to deal with. And by only wave, I mean only boss. And there the air units come. Okay, so they do exist. They just start after the boss. Which I guess is fair, but that should do. Okay, I might just start speeding through these waves too. Because like, there's really not much else I can do here. The only thing I need is glass, and I've used all the lead. And I don't want to like demolish factories, because that's kind of stupid. So we're just going to start plowing through waves. You know what that means though? It's time for a wave destruction montage. Ta-da, there we go. 
Sector captured. Well, uh, overall that wasn't too bad. Only one minor hitch with the uh, quad incident, but other than that, this went pretty smoothly. Well, I say that, it's going smoothly now. In the beginning it was kind of rocky, and then it was fine, and then the quad showed up, and then it was fine, and then the flares started getting through. And then it was fine. So overall, it was fine. Overall, it wasn't that bad of a challenge if you actually pay attention and start getting units built at the beginning of the run instead of at wave 10. Ugh, great. Impact is under attack as per usual. What wave are we on? It's going to survive 15 of 15 waves. We're literally on wave 160. I don't think this place is going to collapse anytime soon. I think we'll be fine. Anyway, that's 197 done. Uh, that's all for me today. I'm going to sit here and look at my massive army and uh, congratulate them for a hard-earned victory. Goodbye.